Hey guys, so originally all this footage uh, was in uh, Eleven Seven's vlog and uh, it was really long because obviously I talk a lot about the YouTube comment system and I'm um, and even after I shot it all, I learned more that it's not in the vlog. So I decided to pull all the footage, make it its own video just around the YouTube comments and leave all the other vlog footage together because it's still equal like 10 minutes. So you have a 10 minute vlog and then now you have uh, about an eight minute video all around the new YouTube comment system. So I uh, just wanted to give you a heads up on that. So here's uh, everything about the new YouTube comments, my opinion, uh, some cool things that I learned and um, hopefully you like this better instead of having one giant vlog where you have to kind of, people who don't care about the comment system have to fast forward. This way, those people don't even have to watch this video. So enjoy. So today I got access to the new YouTube commenting system. First impressions, I love it. I love the Google Plus integration because I'm a big fan of Google Plus. Um, it's gonna take some getting used to though. For example, I can't reply to old comments. So every com all the comments that were there prior to my channel switching over, I can no longer reply to. I can reply to you and start a, con a new conversation on that video and reply that way, but I can't reply directly to any old comments. So that's, that's the first thing. You can now mention people that have a Google Plus profile. So if you have a profile, I can at the, use the at symbol and I can reply back to you. I don't know if that gives you a notification or not or what the ramifications are for that. Uh, but there's that. And then also you can add links to comments now, which is huge, huge. And then lastly, uh, notifications are now going to Google Plus instead of YouTube, which I also like this as well because uh, there really wasn't a notification system for YouTube. There was your inbox that no one ever used. So that's a big win for me. So, all right guys, so um, all day I've been trying to keep up with the whole commenting, YouTube commenting thing and uh, learn as much of it as I could so I could tell you in this video and kind of prompt you on um, the future because this is the future of YouTube. If you get comments on your videos or if someone replies to one of your comments on someone else's video, uh, you'll get a notification up in the top right hand corner of the little bell and it'll be red or orange or whatever telling you have notifications. The cool part, something I just learned just now is I was scared at first because I didn't understand it uh, People, people are scared and uh, are fearful of things they don't understand. Uh, that you get this little like Google Plus uh, post or page, but if you look at the top, it says only visible on YouTube. So even though I'm like reading these and commenting and replying to these on Google Plus, they're going directly to YouTube. So it looks like a Google Plus page, right? There's my profile pic there, tells me how many people I have in my circles. And then right here at the top, right? Only visible on, and it's the YouTube link. And it says, Clintus McGinnis commented on a video on YouTube. Now, at first I thought, because it said shared publicly in the way this looked, like this was on my profile page. But it only goes to your profile if you check that box, uh, published to Google+. So, this is my comment on this uh, video. This is the video that, that YouTube posted for their post today, right? Talking about how it changed. Because there's like 15,000 comments in this video, and they're all basically blowing up YouTube, to calling them idiots and stupid. So, there's my comment. And then, when people reply to me... It shows up down here as replies, right? So far, you follow me? This looks like a Google Plus post, but it's not. It's actually, this is all on YouTube. This is just a cool way of viewing it, which I like a lot. So there's the replies I got, and then there's my replies to them. Now, if we go to this video. Hey guys, it's... All right, so then we scroll down here, and my, my, my comments can be right at the top. Now that's one of the cool things that, that, that YouTube's doing, right? It's automatically gonna put my comments on top so I see them first. And there are the replies. Okay, view all four. There's the first two. There's my two. Look, links to their profiles and mentioning, the, the mentions that I did. And if I click on this, it takes me to their Google Plus page. Also, if you know, I don't know if you noticed that, if I put my mouse over it, it gives me a quick view of their, of the, of their profile. Anyways, so that's, oh, I, I'm digging this so far, guys. I really am. Uh, you can sort right here by top comments, switch it to newest first, so you see the newest comments on top. All right, so there you go, 50 seconds ago. And then you can see the hate. The hate. The haters and trolls are coming out in full force. I still have an issue replying back to your guys' comments. Um, first, I thought it was that I had to be in your Google Plus circle. Maybe that is what it is. But also, you actually have to have a Google Plus for me to reply. Just got a comment from Kelly Braben. 
And so I hit reply, I get my little reply box, right? And I'm just gonna type something in here because I know, I know it's not gonna work, so I'm just typing that in, right? So I hit reply, and I get this right here. You are not allowed to comment on this post. So I can't comment, to, I can't reply directly to Kelly. So the next thing is, I can go in here, and I can at, I can mention Kelly, right? So Kelly, and it starts trying to find her name. Well, if I had her in my circle, she'd be in that top spot of people that I know, right? The only Kelly I actually have circled is Kelly Davis. So I, I keep typing, trying to find her. B-R-A-Y-O-N. And she does not exist in Google+. Plus. It's Braybone. Braybone, well, I spelled the wrong things. Bray, uh, come on. It's because I'm looking through the camera, that's why. There we go, same thing, same result. Kelly Braybon does not have a Google Plus profile. Ooh. And I even confirmed it by going to Google Plus and searching for it. So there's there's limitations, guys, but trust me, I, I, I truly believe that this is gonna be so much better for YouTube uh, and for me as a creator and for you as an audience member that once everyone's kind of in sync and all the dust kind of settles, this is gonna be so much better. So basically, link your YouTube channel to a Google Plus profile. Make sure you circle me so that I can reply to your comments, because you know, you, you guys know I reply to every comment. And it sucks right now because I can't reply to a lot of comments because of that reason. So, get on it! Another cool feature that I'm really digging, guys, is uh, the notifications of new comments, right? So, the little bell on Gmail, on YouTube, on Google, uh, the little bell gives you notifications, right? You click on the bell and you get your notifications, right? So, now comments are in the notifications, right? So, this guy right here mentioned you in a comment on your post. So I click on this. Here's the post that I commented on, right? I commented on the video, that's the one we were talking about earlier. And there's the comment. So I can actually go right in here and I can reply to this comment and it goes directly to the video. I never actually even go, have to go to YouTube. This is awesome. From Gmail, from YouTube, from Google+, I can reply to YouTube comments. That's huge for me, guys, huge. So real quick, new features that I, that I really love um, that I think is a huge win with this whole move with Google+. First and foremost, I can reply to you guys' comments on mobile. Holy crap, you guys, this is huge. I've never been able to actually reply to a comment from mobile. I can leave comments, but I couldn't reply to a comment. Now I can. Uh, I can reply to comments and um, leave comments via Google+, Plus, right, from the notification system. So that's real handy that it leaves, puts all my notifications in one place, and I can view them and reply from them um, from Google+, Plus, whether it's mobile or desktop. With that being said, that notification, that little bell, is in all of Google's products. So Gmail, YouTube, Google+, Plus, um, whatever other ones that are out there that I don't use, anything that has that notification, I can now see when a comment was placed, when I mentioned, and I can reply to them right there from the notifications. I don't have to go to the YouTube video, none of that. Another big thing, actual real threaded comments, right? I reply to everyone's comments, and while I'm viewing it in the all comment view, it looks like, you know, comment, reply, comment, reply. But when you're watching the video, it goes newest to, to oldest, right? So if I reply to 15, 20 comments from a, on a video, all those comments are now bundled, pushed up to the top, and it looks like I just spammed my own my video. I've never been a fan of that, but it's just the way it is. Not anymore. Now it's true threading. Comment, then my reply. Comment, then my reply. And it's even kind of like, kind of like tabbed over. So it's huge, guys. It, it, it looks so much cleaner now, so much cleaner. Um, uh, and another thing that I really like is that um, by default it puts the top comments at the top. So my comments are on the top um, and any um, people that are in my Google Plus circles or that I'm subscribed to or like big named YouTubers, all those go kind of go to the top um, for me it, and it's customized for you, right? So if, if I'm in your circle, my comments are always going to be at the top. If uh, you have Shay Carl or I Justine or, or, or Toby, you know, in your circles or you're subscribed to them, it should recognize that and put their comments towards the top. So you're always gonna see their comments first. That's awesome, you guys, that's so awesome. When I go to a video that I've left a comment on, my comments at the top, I can quickly get to it and see if any, my, the replies that I've gotten on my comment. There's just so many, in my opinion, so many benefits to this move. And I know most people are complaining that they don't want a Google Plus account. Here's the thing. You can have a Google Plus account and not use it. You already have an account. You have a Gmail account, you have a Google Plus account. You just haven't used it. You haven't logged in. You haven't linked it, right? So do that five minute link job and then you never have to log in again. You can do everything from YouTube. You don't have to use Google Plus. So I think that's that's the key that people are missing is that um, Google's moving this integration and, and integrating all their stuff together. That Google bar at the top integrates them all together. 
you can hot swap to any of the Google apps right from the top. I think that's great. I think this is a big benefit. I'm a big fan. So leave your comments down below what you think of the new comment system. I'm really curious what you think. Uh, what are the problems that you're running into? What are the questions you have? I will try to answer them the best I can. And let's have a discussion because that's the whole point of this new change is a dis having a discussion on the videos.